Hey everyone, hope you guys are doing great. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to add grass on your logo and make it animated. So, let's take a look what we'll try to make today. This is the demo that I made for this tutorial. We'll try to make just like this one. Okay, let's try to make from the beginning. So, I'm going to create a composition and call it grass any and set a preset hdb1080 then drag my logo inside of grass any composition now put this logo layer inside of a precomp by selecting the layer and press ctrl shift c at a time okay double click this logo precomp and in this moment we need to change composition settings and logo fill color now press ctrl k for the settings and select a preset HDB 1080 select this logo layer go to effect generate fill and change the color into green now going back to grass any comp and select this layer go to effect simulation CC here in this moment we need to change some parameter of CC here I'm going to change length into 4.41.0 thickness 2.57 with minus 2.380 density 1000.5 expand this here full map I'm going to change map strength into 851.0 map softness 0.1 add noise 100.0 expand this here color feature I'm going to change color into green and keep color inheritance as it is opacity as it is shading as it is and check this constant mass checkbox okay now I'm going to animate this here effects by simply set keyframe for length thickness and width from the beginning of timeline expand this logo layer control go to one second 50 frame 15 frame set another keyframe for length and width our length should be 47 and width 6.986 go to 3 second 21 frames and change the length value into 0 and weight should be 1.920 
now move this thickness keyframe first keyframe and go to 7 second change the thickness below into 0 In this moment, I am duplicate this logo layer and delete the CC here effect just because we need to keep our fresh logo. Bring back to it and okay now make this two layer into 3d by simply select and switch on this 3d option i think we need to change this custom view into active camera and create a new camera okay now make a simple camera animation by expand this camera transform parameters and go to frame 0 set keyframe for all this just from values and select this track Z camera tool zoom in go to frame one second one and zoom out this look static just because I think we need to change here width from in zero frame here width should be minus 2.38 all right Now continue zoom out camera animation to 10 seconds. It's look better. Need to create a solid white background. Create a new solid. It should be white. Bring it down. I think the logo color is too bright. We need to adjust this color. Double click this pre comp, logo pre comp, and select this logo layer and change the color. Go back to grass any comp and create a new solid for animated background. It can be any color. All right. Now go to effect, generate, radio wave. Now change some parameters of radio waves. 
expand this polygon parameter and make it 6 frequency 0 0.40 expansion to 1.60 live spam second 3.800 and check this reflection change the opacity into 0 0.300 fade in time 1.800 fade out time 2.600 start with 7.60 and 1.00 we need to change this blue color into dark gray all right so we are very near now we need to create a text layer and switch on this 3d option We can animate this text layer also. Go to effects and preset window. Expand this animation preset. Expand text folder. Animate it. Animate in. Fade up by character okay hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and try yourself to use after effects native feature more creatively thank you